hey what's up guys it's chocolate cam doll back with another video so today i have a story time and this just happened it's so fresh it's so new and i say you know what why not get my views and put out another video for vlogmas and why not put another video out on youtube just to create my content and get my views up so yeah like let's get it so this story time is about this girl trying to expose me for being a webcam model so a little bit of background about this girl me and her both stream on the same apps right she is a top badge on one app a top badge is basically like um someone that accumulates a lot of diamonds they have like a a lot of followers and they've been on the app for like over a year sometimes top badges are on the app for like you know two three years five years you know they, they basically have status they have a lot of uh they have a lot of um diamonds i get you know you could say so i'm going in her live trying to support her trying to like just get in there trying to network with her but she was like mm, no you clout chasing ass bitch you do only fans i don't like you i don't want to be your friend i don't want to associate with you you're low vibrational you and all those other two dollar hoes y'all are low vibrational anyone who sells their cooch is very low vibrational and like you guys are just the scum of the earth you guys are just ugh, disgusting and I'm like, okay, um, for one, your words are not hurting me because that's what I expect from women on the outside looking in to this industry, women, women on the outside looking in to this industry. That's what I expect from them. I expect them to say things like that. So it was no shock, no surprise to me. The thing that got me was when she showed her whole live stream, my accounts. She showed them my OnlyFans account. And I'm like, why would you do that? Why would you show my pictures and my videos <laughs> to your live stream? And I said, well... Thanks for the free promotion because, you know, on most of these live streaming apps, it's mostly guys that view your room anyway. So I'm like, well, you have a room full of guys. You're giving me free promotion. You're showing all of my social media. You're telling them about my YouTube. You're telling them about my loyal fans. Okay, well, thank you for the free promotion. And to say that we're, to say that we're low vibrational and you know, we're cheap and we're two dollar hoes and we're da da da. Um, but you're you're a free hoe, you fuck for meals and you fuck for good morning text, you fuck for attention and validation. That's honestly not a hoe, that's a slut. That's what sluts do, they, they fuck for validation. They fuck for attention. That's what sluts do. You are talking down. Now, girls in the industry, you, we all know. Y'all all know. We do, we do not care what these girls do with their bodies. Their body is their body. If they want to go F around on the whole world and da 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 and be uh, whatever okay that's them that is their body that is their choice no one's no one cares but the problem comes when they're looking down on us and literally saying i'm better than you because i don't do that because you do that and i don't do it i'm better than you but meanwhile, most of these women are single mothers. They're unmarried, single mothers, on food stamps, on Section 8, 
they're getting stuffed up with D for, for free. Bills are not paid. The guys that are entertaining them are not paying their bills. They some some of them not they don't even get some of them are not even getting food. They're just getting free D. They're just getting free sex. That's it. Some of them are just getting dick and attention. And they're getting scents on their way. Well, okay, I'll talk to you later. I'll, I'll, I'll call you when I want some more pussy. That, 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 that's all they get. So you're talking down on sex workers when you're probably sending guys pussy pictures for free. You're probably on your back for free. I'm pretty sure of it. You're probably on your back and then after he's finished with you and after he leaves... You're still worrying about how you're going to pay your light bill and how you're going to pay your water bill because you forgot to get your money first. You're one of those women that get on your back, spread your legs, and you're left with a wet ass and an empty purse. You're left looking stupid because this guy ain't even bought you a cheeseburger. He ain't even bought you no food. He ain't even bought you nothing to drink. He ain't even he ain't even uh, checked your changed your oil, but he got some pussy from you. Now, how low vibrational and cheap is that? That that's cheap right there. Giving your body up for free. Because because let's let's be real. He who is without sin shall cast the first stone, right? Or shall I throw the first stone, right? Is that is that how it go? Is that is that's how it how it said? It may not be exactly, but y'all know what I mean. So if we really gonna play this, oh I'm holier than thou type of shit, let's really get into it. Because a lot of y'all women who are not in the industry, okay, you may not be a sex worker, but you're fornicating, you're committing adultery. You are judging. You are gossiping. That's a sin too. That's low vibrational too. So let's let's all talk about it. Let's talk about how they want to sh- they want to shame one thing, but oh, everything else is okay. No, it's all not okay. It's all low vibrational. Because like I said, we don't care about what y'all do with y'all bodies. But what we do care about is why are sex workers named? Why are we always in your mouth? Why are we always the topic of discussion between you and your other holier than thou friends who think they're better because, oh, I have a boyfriend, but your boyfriend is paying our bills. Oh, I have a husband and your husband is paying our bills. Your husband, your boyfriend is cheating on you with the with the same women that you look down on. The the same women that you look down on, your husband, boyfriend, fiance or is paying their bills. And, and child, let me not get into it because most of my because <laughs> If we're going to talk about hoes, all of us are hoes. So, some of us are sluts. sluts. A slut is someone that sleeps around for free and gets nothing at all in return except for dick and attention. Now, a hoe is short for hooker, which means they get paid. They get paid for pictures, videos, phone calls, video calls, set, everything. We, we, we get our bills paid. We get our bills paid paid we get cash apps we get paypals we get cash honey we're not on (laughs) we're not entertaining men for free but i don't care about what anyone does with their body but what i do care about is women thinking that they're better because they don't sell themselves but you're better because you gave it to him for free that makes you better Mm, I think that makes you more stupid it doesn't make you better it makes you more naive more green more stupid that's what it makes you 
sleeping with a man for free, being left with the with the you, you, you <laughs> you're left with a wet ass in a stack of bills on your table. You're left with a wet ass in a stack of unpaid bills on your damn table. Now, how low vibrational and cheap is that? Since since the words that came out of your mouth, oh, yo, you guys are cheap and low vibrational. All you hoes are stupid. How how stupid and cheap and low vibrational is that? To have a man all up in your shit, coming all up in you, making leaving you with a wet behind and unpaid bills on the table. And just walked out after he's done with you he's out the door wham bam thank you ma'am and he'll see you next time the next time he wants some that's when he'll see you that's the next time you'll see him other than that you won't see him now how low vibrational and cheap is that these women really be stupid sluts the women that judge sex workers, they're all sluts. That's what I'm going to call them. Not all women. Just the women the women who judge sex workers are all stupid sluts. That's what they are to me. Because you the pot calling the kettle black. We do the same exact thing. Except the only difference is I'm getting paid. And you just getting laid. We do the exact same thing, but the only difference is I'm getting paid and you just getting laid, baby girl. But anyways, (laughs) y'all, don't let these people bother y'all. Don't let these people ruin your day because they try to expose you when they're trying to say, oh, you do OnlyFans, you do webcam, you do porn, you do, you do yada, yada, yada. Okay, and so what? I'm a grown as a woman who pays my own bills who buys whatever I want to buy with my SW money with my OnlyFans money my my OnlyFans money is buying me all the clothes, all the wigs all of the jewelry, all, all of the shoes and outfits all of, all, all of the bills are paid is getting my nails done is getting my makeup like is is getting whatever I want that's what that is doing that's that's what that's what my money is doing the money I'm getting from your possibly your husband and your boyfriend because you, you never know he, he might be subscribed to my shit who, who knows <laughs> you know they be using fake names fake fake names to subscribe and shit <laughs> Anyways, um, don't let these people bother y'all. Like, if, if someone got something to say, he, here's the thing. Here's what a lot of people say. It, it may sound cliche, but it's true. My thing is, if they not paying your bills, they shouldn't get under your skin. If they not paying your bills, their opinions don't matter if they're not paying your bills their opinions their statements their comments should not matter keep you a grown-ass woman at the end of the day as long as your bills is paid as long as you eating you saving your money you you're, you're drinking your water you able to sleep at night because everything is good like as long as everything is good as far as your bills and you eating food and you got a roof over your table i mean (laughs) a roof over your head and food on the table i say f what everybody else gotta say because everybody else is gonna always have something to say they're gonna always judge you they're gonna always talk crap about you they're gonna always look down on you but guess what the same the same girls that looking down on you for doing um sex work is the same ones that's being used for their bodies and men the men that are using them for their bodies at the end of the day, they call us the same thing. But guess what? They're going to talk more trash about you because he ain't gave you nothing. 
to do what he just did. He ain't he he gonna tell ish about her and say, dang, she was easy. I ain't had to do nothing to get her. I ain't had to take her out to eat or gave her no money. I ain't got nothing. I ain't gave her nothing to get her. She was easy. That's what they gonna say about you. But for girls like me, it's a challenge. You know, I don't care how you think, oh my god, who who would pay for her? Da 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 da. Anyways. Um, but yeah, people are going to always have something to say. Just stay true to yourself. Stay true to yourself. Do what you do. As long as your bills is paid, that's all that matters. And as long as you happy, that is all that matters. As long as you're doing whatever you want to do, that is all that matters. And I'm going to just go ahead and leave on that note. And make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and also um, join my Discord. And also, if you would like to subscribe to my Ebony Etiquette channel, you can do so as well. I'm going to go ahead and link, I'm going to link my um, channels in my description box if you want to subscribe to them. And, uh... What else? What else? Yeah, don't let these people bother. Like, don't let these judgmental, negative Nancys try to talk down on your career and what you choose to do with your life because guess what? They're mad because they can't do it. They're mad because they man is watching you and they just mad. But yeah, y'all, um, like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.